praise. Amen. We praise God in life and we praise Him in death. Yes, amen. Amen. So we are thankful. Amen. So Bishop comes with a dedicate his ashes. Amen. To amen. In life and memory of Jesus. Amen. Let all God's people say praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. We just wanted to do this very quickly. Amen. As we prepare. Amen. To, to leave and to go fellowship and to prepare to come back. Some of you may have the opportunity to know uh, Brother Gary. Amen. Yes. He was faithful unto the Lord. Amen. Yes. He gave his life unto the Lord. And he just didn't stop there. He gave his life unto the community. Amen. Yes. It's, it's tragic and it's sad. Amen. That what happened to him. Amen. But guess what? It could happen to any one of us. Amen. Yes. And the sad part, amen, is that it still can happen. Amen. It's only by the grace of God there go all of us. Amen. Yes. So I thought it was fitting, amen, that even in his life and in, in, in his death, amen, that he thought enough of God's deliverance, praise and outreach center, amen, to leave his home, amen, and to our amen. care. Amen. amen. And we just wanted to do something publicly, amen, and then his sister, amen, knew of our relationship that she felt, amen, that she made sure that we had some ashes, amen, that we could begin to do whatever that we wanted to do. So I found, found it not to be robbery, amen, that we can have a permanent place here, amen. Anytime that anybody do something for the glory of God, do something major, amen, that's to leave it, your home, amen. Thank you, as to leaving your home, Amen. And so you let the church that you belong to. Amen. Love is what love does. Amen. Yeah. Nevertheless, if we don't, amen, ever come together and make it the house, amen, that we want it to be, amen, he did his part. Amen. And we thank God for him. So we're going to ask that, amen, Pastor Lincoln will come. We're going to have a prayer, amen, as we begin to dedicate this. Even after I'm gone home and to be with the Lord, we want this plan. Amen. We'll take care of it. We'll change it. Amen. Whatever we have to do. Amen. That this will always be a permanent place, a permanent part of God's deliverance. Amen. You don't understand, amen. A, a house of the value, even in a terrible market, is valued at almost a hundred thousand dollars. Amen. So it goes to show, amen, the love that he had, first of all, for me, amen. And we know that uh, Brother Gary loved me, and second of all, that his sister, amen, knew the love that he had for us. Anybody else, well, you know how folk get when it comes to assets and things, amen. She said, no, that's, she wouldn't even, she had beat me the first time, amen. We talked about three minutes, and within that three-minute conversation, she said, I knew that my brother loved you and wanted the church to have that house, amen. So we give God the glory. Guess what, y'all? We need to live, amen, so God can lead, use us, amen. amen. We need to live, amen. If we say we love this church, amen. We all know, amen, that we're going to check up out of here, amen. And we know whatever you do in your life, amen, when you're gone, it's going to stop. So if you care enough for anything or anyone, amen, you will make sure Amen. It's called what? An inheritance. When we all leave this place, amen, we can leave something to our children. We can leave something to our children. Sure, we can leave something to the ones we love. And we can leave something to our church, amen, to, to make sure that this church is always open. Amen. That's my goal, amen. Even I took a policy out to leave for the church. So that's the last thing that y'all have to worry about, amen, is worrying about finances on how the church is going to make it. Just as much as I love my wife, amen, just as much as I love my children, I did the same for everything for my church. Amen. Just something to think about. Everyone standing. You've got to have the praise. The word of God.